forecast with meteorologist Jackson Chastain starts now. Well, it's definitely been kind of an interesting day in terms of the weather. Now we've had scattered showers and storms making their way across much of the viewing area. This is a live look from Mifflin Town where they're kind of closer to the action that we're seeing this afternoon where this morning we actually had a tornado warning. How about that? Two tornado warnings in the same week. Not something you typically see uh, really in the month of June or in Pennsylvania in general, unless we have some kind of a severe weather outbreak. And so that second round of storms is starting to make its way off to the east at a relatively rapid pace. I'm not saying everyone's going to get some rain, but something to watch out for as you kind of plan around your evening. Uh, if you have any evening outdoor plans, certainly not any under any kind of a severe weather risk. But with what we've seen this morning, if any one of these storms can hit kind of a weird boundary or something like that, the potential for the quick spin up, certainly a possibility. So that's something we'll be watching very, very closely over the over the coming hours. But really, for the most part, really uh, not expecting anything uh, out other than the ordinary, which is your run of the mill garden variety thunderstorms dropping down into the 60s as you get into the evening tonight. Some very nice conditions coming up uh, again. This trend of cool weather has continued uh, for the past little while and, and while we've heated up we've also cooled down thanks to that cold front we had several days ago and uh, what we're seeing right now with this pattern is this a very favorable pattern that has brought us showers over the past probably you know three days and and that's lingered around now that's going to change heading into the weekend we don't have as much moisture and um, especially as you get basically past your dinner time things are going to dry out very rapidly so by the time you get to uh, close to midnight not really expecting a whole lot uh, really anywhere across the viewing area in terms of rain and drought conditions have been worsening. We just got the latest drought report that was on Thursday and that puts most of the state under a moderate uh, moderate level of drought uh, in many places dry if not under a risk for drought. They've put us um, under that drought watch the state of Pennsylvania. So we'll be watching that. We'll be keeping that situation, keeping tabs on it, and we'll keep you updated as we get new and interesting information. But uh, heading into your Father's Day, uh, nice weather, pretty warm. And then as the beginning of summer cranks off, it feels a lot more like summer because you get close to 90 by the time you get to the end of the week. So it will be kind of an interesting the week to watch because we're not expecting a lot in terms of rain. We've gotten a few signals uh, that maybe some potential could be out there, but overall the pattern has been uh, warming, warming, warming. And so if you like warming weather, I know Valerie, you do. I do. Uh, so take advantage this next next week. All Good right. info, Jackson. Thanks. Hey, thank you so much. And we'll be right back.